I am more astounded that you managed to beat your emetophobia despite being all over the world filming 30 different films and series. That's bonkers. It was still on my mind every day and I would be very conscious about what food I would eat on set and worried about if there was a bug going around or who looked ill and who didn't. There's times when it felt like the, even the air around me was like a threat. It impacted pretty much every area of my life. I never really tried to overcome it for like a long period of time. All these like self-help manuals that I had or things that I tried, I just knew reading them, like, I'm like, this just isn't gonna work. It felt like none of them understood what it was. Like nobody really got it. That was obviously different to when you, when you found the Thrive Program. I was actually filming West Witch at the time. I was meant to be in tutoring during school and I was just Googling like emetophobia cures and the Thrive Program popped up and I was like, hmm, what is this? This looks interesting. It seemed to like describe exactly what it was in a way that nothing I'd ever seen had before. The Thrive Program teaches you how your mind works. You're the one actually doing all the work. So if you really put your all into it, there's no way that it like can't work. I say that to people. <laughs> Mm. Why do you say that? Because it's, like, logical and it's grounded in so much research. There are about 12 million English-speaking emetophobia sufferers. What would you say to them? <laughs> I would say 